public transport for many thousands in Sydney's southwest. And as Gary Scully reports, the Premier didn't miss the chance to link the occasion with the coming state elections. For Premier Barry Unsworth, the opening went off with a bang. It was the missing link in Sydney's rail system, talked about by successive governments for 30 years. For thousands in the burgeoning southwestern suburbs, it means quicker and more flexible public transport. The major engineering project has converted the single track from Riverwood to East Hills into a double line and extended eight kilometres to join the main southern line at Glenfield. Premier Barry Unsworth said he hadn't really come to talk politics, but... There's an election coming on next year, and I want to take every opportunity to tell the people of New South Wales the difference between a Labor government and a Conservative government. And he did. Well, there's too many knockers around. Even though. our doctors. Well, listen, all the doctors are all, they're all conservatives. That's a project. Now, under the Liberals, that would, the Harris Park Y would be uh, consigned to the archives. Despite a rail strike threat to the bicentennial, Premier Unsworth seemed confident he could win over the Railways Union at talks this week. I take the view that the unions are realistic and uh, the members should recognise that our government supports their claim. In any case, he obviously wasn't letting that shadow spoil the golden opportunities today.